To me, architectural engineering is whole building design. It's looking at how buildings work, how they function, not just how they stand up, but what goes into them in the first place to make them work properly. Architectural engineering is a discipline that brings together elements from architecture, structural engineering, and mechanical and electrical engineering. Even though it has this broad range of elements, it brings these together in a focused and targeted way towards sustainable design. I chose architectural engineering because I knew that I was interested in buildings and how they worked and how they were put together, but not 100% sure of the exact route I wanted to take. So with such a broad uh, range of education and subjects covered, I thought that I would be able to get into the career that I'd want in the end. My day-to-day -day job involves uh, working in the Bridges team uh, in the infrastructure department. So this involves assessments, uh, designs from first principles and all the way up to inspections. So I get to go out and actually inspect existing structures as well. I model buildings um, on the computer, so trying to predict how they'll perform in real life when they're actually in the ground. Um, this ranges from predicting how much energy they might use, the carbon they might emit, or how comfortable the people might be inside them. I work on um, conceptual design to uh, detailed design. Um, as an example, um, we worked on a, a building in Kathmandu where we took the lead with the architect to um, inform the form and shape of the building to promote natural ventilation and decrease heat gains. The architectural engineering course is really useful. It's got a joint accreditation, so even from undergraduate studies you're used to working in a multidisciplinary team which all project, building projects in the real world are. Well, I think the course is perfectly suited for working in the building industry. Changes in the regulation means there's new supervisory roles that need to be thought of from concept stage all the way up to handover, and I think this course is best suited for that. Architectural engineering teaches us to look at building design in a holistic way, which is really the only true way that you can design in a sustainable way. A career in architectural engineering creates a massive opportunity. It's estimated by 2030 some 70% of people will be living in cities and that's going to be around 4 billion people. So the challenges that this presents in terms of energy, carbon, water, mobility and of course the design of the cities themselves is immense. For graduates trained in architectural engineering with a multidisciplinary understanding, they've got the opportunity to come in and address some of these issues. Here at Arup we work across all of these sectors and our teams have lots of graduates from the University of Sheffield course. People have worked on schools in Africa, the London Olympics, and of course the Diamond here in Sheffield. Architectural engineers are in demand the world over, and so many of our graduates have travelled and worked overseas too. It's hard to think of a more rewarding career in terms of the positive impact that you can make and the kind of experiences that you can gain.